Okay, perfect. Hey, um, coaches, so today's uh, plan or tomorrow's plan here is uh, for the week. Uh, we're doing um, a creative 1v1 dribbling. Uh, we've done a lot of passing and um, we're going back a little bit to the individuality uh, this week. So the first exercise um, is the variety drill. It has a technical, physical, and ball mastery component to it. So um, the players are eight yards apart from each other. And so what they're doing is they're shuffling the ball between their feet stationary all together. And when you say go, they're going to jog up to each other or, um, yeah, whatever pace you want them to do. And they're going to jump up and bump each other's chest or stomach or whatever you want to call it. <laughs> doesn't matter what you – just to get a little bit of physicality a little bit in there. And um, a little uh, contact, being able to, um, yeah, have contact. And so the next exercise, so you do that about for four reps or something. You know, they shuffle the ball. And then after four reps, um, you move on to the next one, which would be toe taps. They all do stationary toe taps. And when you say go, they jog up to each other and uh jump up in the air and give each other a shoulder bump and then jog back to the ball and uh, resume with toe taps. So you do that about four times again and then you move on to the next one, which would be then, um, um, I'm just making sure, you know, uh, when you're going to the lesson plan, I had them do pull Vs, yeah. So you do stationary pull Vs. I, I have them all in single, have yet. So the question, Eugene, is are yeah. this guy's going at the same time, same yeah. time? And then Correct. They chest bump? Yeah, they do a chest bump. And then they, they jump up and then they bump. dribble back. Correct. And it's only yeah. one guy per line. Correct. Just, just, they do just uh, yeah, one guy per line. Okay. They all do it at the same time. All eight of them do it at the same time. Got it. Okay. Okay. Perfect. Yeah, and the next one would be a shoulder bump. So toe taps and then shoulder bump. So they're going to toe tap all of here to turn um, in one direction and go shoulder to shoulder? Correct. Maybe two two times uh, the right shoulder bump and then two times Are they jumping shoulder. up on this one? Are they jumping? Yeah, they are. Okay. They are. Okay. So a little timing, uh, spatial awareness, um, a little bit of that. So there's really Everything. no rest then because everybody's going – Shoulder, shoulder, come back, and then they go again. Yeah, you could. They they would be jogging at a light pace, so that's okay. kind of you're yeah. not you're not having them sprint the whole time, or you know. So it's it's a doable exercise. Okay. Cool. And okay, so the next one would be where they do pull V's stationary. Okay. Yeah. Right. So we go down to the bottom pull mastery stationary okay. moves go at each other. So. Pull V stationary, so all eight of them would do pull Vs stationary. Uh -huh. And then when you say go, they dribble at each other and do a scissor. And if you want more advanced, they can do a double scissor. And then after they do a double scissor, they will um, dribble to the opposite line. Got it. So they do a double scissor at each other. So these guys are doing pull Vs, pull Vs, pull Vs, yeah. pull Vs, and then you say go. And yes. They can dribble, scissor left, go right, and then they go, correct. This guy's gonna go. Oh, this guy's gonna end up on this side. That's right. And this guy and will that end up. Yeah, will side. end up on that side. Right. Correct. Okay. Stationary pull V's got it. Okay. And then um, the next one will be cut takes. So inside, outside, inside, outside, alternating both feet. So they do cut takes. Both feet, same thing, stationary. stationary. So inside and left, outside right, inside right, outside left, side to side. Correct. Okay. Yes, correct. Got it. And then you say go again, and then they do a different move. It could be a double move. It could be a step over with the right, lunge right, take left. Got it. Okay. And then uh, after that, I had uh, them do um, – a chaos game, and I think, you know, that's the chaos game where you have the goals all ver uh, vertical. Okay, yep. In one you're, line. you're stacking them. Yeah, you're stacking them. 
Yeah. Yeah. So you got one, two, three, four, That's and then one. Yep. Yep. I got it. Okay. Two. Two. Uh, three three and, four. and four. Perfect. Got it. Okay. Something like that. Yes. Got yes. It. And then yeah, that. Team one will play against team three, and then team two will play against team four. Got it. And is it one v ones or two v twos? It two v twos, three two v twos, and depending on the numbers, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Okay. Got it. I didn't need I, with all the yeah. I, I just didn't feel a need to draw that one. Okay. Got it. We've done that one before. Cool. And. And then this game, this little game was, right uh, yeah, that's a little reaction game. And so the two lines are passing the ball back and forth, one touch. One touch, okay. Boom, yeah, one touch, boom, 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 going boom. back and forth. And then at the coach's signal, you know, if it's yellow, they all sprint to the yellow uh, cone. And the first one to get there gets a point. Okay. Yeah. And then the next guy. And then, yeah, and then the next guy, correct. Yep. Okay. Yeah. What are some variations? So, yeah, yeah, the variation, there's variation too where um, they go to opposite color. So if you say yellow, they go to red. And if you say red, they go to yellow. Got it. Okay. We've done yeah. a lot of reaction game. And these are only what, uh, from, from where they're standing, maybe six yards, seven yards? Yeah, six it? yards apart. Okay. Yep. Okay. Six, six yards. yards apart. Total of 12 yards, right? Yeah. Got it. Okay. Cool. Got it. Okay. Okay. And, I mean, if, if you have time, you can have another variation where they go, when you say yellow, they can go from yellow, they sprint to yellow, and then change direction, go to red. Uh, okay. Got it. So if it if they wanted to do boom, if, boom. Yeah. Okay. Correct. Got yeah. It. Cool. Okay. And what is the purpose for these reactionary games? What are you training? What's the purpose? You know, we're training the mental, the the speed of thought, um, agility is in there. Yeah. Um, Could you do variations then, like running here and going backwards? Would you recommend that or? Like yeah, you could. Yeah, you you can. Of, I'm, I'm I'm encouraging coaches to come up some with some yeah different. Um, yeah, if they wanted to do that, that that would be an awesome uh, um, and variation. Huh? Yeah, some variation. Yeah, okay, cool. you, coaches are allowed to be creative. Got it. Okay. Yeah. All right, and then you're and in the one v one. Are you you take twenty minutes? Probably ten, huh? Oh, is that uh, well? It's the chaos and the reaction oh, chaos. all it. together. Okay. Yeah. All right. All right. So okay. And here's the one v one. Okay. I'm excited for this one because, uh, um, so player in white passes the ball to the maroon player, and okay, so immediately the I'm pressures. Sorry. I'm sorry. So the box is 12 yards by 12 yards. I see. Yeah. Two goals yeah. and two gates. This guy yeah. plays the ball across. Mm-hmm. Okay, boom. Okay, and then he can go either side. Yeah, yeah. He dribbles through the, either uh, gate. Yeah. Okay. So they have to receive the ball in movement, um, in their first touch, okay. and then they can start dribbling. And so the the objective is to get past the two yellow cones before they can score. Okay. Right here. Yes. Okay. So it's kind of a change for attacking, but changing direction too, right? You can change. Correct. Direction. Okay. Yes. Okay, There's change of direction, yeah, uh, in uh, a couple of scenarios. One is the first touch, and then through the cones is changing the direction, and then a 1v1 move, and they can decide to change direction and go the other way too. So okay. lots of uh, variety okay. in this. Now, I added, now the counter I mean, goal is these go gates, right? Yeah, yeah. Now I'm noticing this is 12 yards, so it's probably going to be a 15-yard pass. So could he or this player take it through through here? Do you know and go through this way? Because so, okay. so he can meet yeah. the ball. Yeah, sure. Because I think by the time he passes it, he can move on a couple yards, and then then his first touch can go through here, right? 
you could do that too yeah yeah and then he goes uh, i'm i've already I've, I've, in the description i told them to make sure that they play it firm okay got it okay but um if yeah if if they can meet the ball and dribble through the gates they can go that way too okay. yeah all right either way i'm, I'm okay with that yeah okay. and then Coaches can work on different variation on their touches, probably, huh? Like outside, yeah, they foot, can inside, outside, outside, across the body, um, across the body. Correct, yeah. outside of the foot. Okay. Um, different, yeah. different ways to receive it. Okay, cool. Yes, and then I had a variation too, is where they uh, receive, leave the ball, and they have to do a Maradona through the goal. Uh, okay, so they take it through here, yeah, first touch, and then Maradona spin, and then in. Yeah, and then get through the gate. And if you want them to do, if your players are more advanced, have them do a scissor or a double scissor, and then go at the player and do it again. So just getting, just putting different challenges on them, huh? Yes, okay. yes. Okay. If they can meet up to those challenges, yeah. if Got some it. of them can't, then uh, keep it simple. Got it. Okay. Good. Yeah. All right. The last. Yeah, the last one is uh, 3v3. Just regular 3v3. Uh, yeah, just, no passing zone. Oh, yeah, I noticed yeah. that. Yeah. Where's the ball so, there? So if they're in their own half, they uh, they cannot pass the ball. They have to dribble Okay. Um, okay. Yeah, no. over the halfway line before they can share the ball in the attacking half. Okay. And um, halfway through the – I mean, um, halfway through that – so 15 minutes after that, or 12, uh, you switch the no pass zone to the attacking zone and the optional into the defensive. So okay. just to give them a different uh, look. Are these with big goals, or what do you have here? Yeah, um, if yeah, if, if you can go four v four or okay. um, to okay. big goals, I I've also done them with small goals before too. If you don't have big goals, so. But I prefer, yeah, if you can have big goals where players get to shoot. Yeah, I want shooting. Yeah. Let's get these five guys out here. Okay. Yeah. That's what we use. And if, if your team really is in need of, of shooting, in the in that 1v1 drill, you can have a goal there too, you know? But what? just have a line where they have to dribble past the line for them to shoot. But, yeah. Okay. Encourage, encourage uh, yeah, getting goals out there. Okay. Yeah. Any uh, other things? Yeah. I think just, that's it. You said where would you put goals in here? Um, I would say it, you could, you could, you can flip the field and just put gates uh, um, on the right and left, and just put the goal here. And um, do you see my arrow or not? No, I don't. Oh, you don't. Yeah. Okay, mm. now let's just stick with this. That's yeah. We got, so. Okay. Okay, cool. All right. Uh, okay. Is that it? That's it. Okay, awesome. Awesome. Thanks, Gino. You bet. Okay. Bye. Okay, thanks, guys.